But yes, this should be fun. This should be real good. Long ago, two races ruled over Earth, humans and monsters. One day, war broke out between the two races. After a long battle, the humans were victorious. They sealed the monster underground with a magic spell. Many years later, Mount Ebot 2001X. Legends say that those who climb the mountain never return. Oh, oh dear. Hello, demon, how are you? Oh dear. Straight down into a pit, he or she falls. Looks like a girl to me. Oh dear. Let's start. Name the fallen human. What are we gonna name her, chat? Him or her? Carrot? Kyle? Human? Hey, why not? That sounds good to me. Done. Yes. Call me human. Oh, hello. Silent. Howdy, I'm Flowey. Flowey in the flower. Ooh. You're new to the underground, aren't you? Golly, you must be so confused. Someone ought to teach you how things work around here. I guess a little old me will have to do. Ready? Here we go! See that heart? That is your soul, the very culmination of your being. Your soul starts out weak, but you can go strong if you gain a lot of LV. What's LV stand for? My love, of course. You want some love, don't you? Don't worry, I'll share some with you. Winky face. Down here, love is shared through little white friendliness pellets. Are you ready? Move around, get as many as you can. Okay, oh man. Hey buddy, you miss them. Oh. Let's try again, okay? Is that a joke? Are you brain dead? Run into the bullets! Okay, I'm not gonna lie, I played this. And I've never done this. You know what's going on here, don't you? You just wanted to see me suffer. <laughs> yeah, I played that part before. And I knew if you touch it, yeah, you know, I knew the flowers messed up. The flowers kind of, hmm. Die! <laughs> oh god, please, no. <laughs> what a terrible creature, torturing such a poor, innocent youth. Oh, do not be afraid, my child. Toriel, taker, caretaker of the ruins. I pass through this place every day to see if anyone has fallen down. You are the first human to come here in a long time. Come, I will guide you through the catacombs. <laughs> you did the same thing because you saw combat in the same images and was like, how about no? 
this way. Oh, I love the music in this game. The music in this game is unbelievable. What's this thing? Can I interact with it? The shadow of the ruins loom above, filling you with determination. HP fully restored. Ruin entrance. Save. Nice. Let's follow Toriel. Welcome to your new home, innocent one. Indeed, this game is a true relic. Allow me to educate you in the operation of the ruins. are full of puzzles, ancient fusions between divergence and door keys. One must solve them to move from room to room. Please adjust yourself to the sight of them. What do you class as a relic game then, Demon? Indeed, this game is a true relic. To make progress here, you will need to trigger several switches. Do not worry, I have labeled the ones that you need to play. That's dead to read signs. Or, um, enter. Also works. <clears throat> there we go. Splendid. I'm proud of you, little one. Let us move to the next room. What the hell happens if you pull that switch, I wonder? As a human living in the underground, monsters may attack you. You will need to be prepared for this situation. However, worry not. The process is simple. When you encounter a monster, you will enter a fight. While you are in a fight, strike up a friendly conversation. Stall for time. I will come to resolve the conflict. Practice talking to the dummy. Um, act? Talk. You talk to the dummy. It doesn't seem much for a conversation. Toriel seems happy with you. <laughs> you won to XP and a gold. Wow. Murder the dummy and dance on its grave, lol. That voice, thank you. How's it going, Wesley? Ah, very good. You are very good. The first time I played this game, I attacked it, and then she got pissed. Um, hey there. <laughs> this is another puzzle in this room. I wonder if you can solve it. Oh, there is another puzzle in this room. Let's talk. Forget didn't understand what you said, but was flattered anyways. <laughs> you won. And zero XP and zero gold. No. This game is very much a relic. I need to play this game multiple times. Wait, what? This is a puzzle, but I... Here, take my hand for a moment. seem a little too dangerous for now. You've done excellently thus far, my child. However, I have a difficult request to ask of you. I would like to... I would like you to walk to the end of the room by yourself. Forgive me for this. What's going on? I don't understand why she just ran off without us, but hey. I'm sure that will be explained later, possibly. Greetings, my child. Do not worry. I did not leave you. I was merely behind this pillar the whole time. 
<laughs> the name of that track is Unnecessary Tension. Thank you for trusting me. However, there was an important reason for this exercise. To test your independence. I must attend to some business and you must stay alone for a while. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The track whilst I was walking alone in the room. Called Unnecessary Tension. That's quite funny. Please remain here. It's dangerous to explore by yourself. I have an idea. I will give you a cell phone. If you have a need for anything, just call. Be good, alright? No, don't leave me alone, Mama. Thing. Oh no, this is Toriel. You have not left the room, have you? There are a few puzzles ahead that I have yet to explain. It would be dangerous to try to solve them yourself. Be good, alright? Click. Oh, no. Ribbit, ribbit. Excuse me, human. I have some advice for you about battling monsters. <laughs> if you act a certain way or fight until you almost defeat them, they might not want to battle you anymore. If a monster does not want to fight you, please use some mercy, human ribbit. The first time I played this game, I didn't even freaking. <sighs> yeah. Call and flirt with her. I didn't even know about the talking. I just thought it was a joke and killed everything. Playfully crinkling through the leaves fills you with determination. HP funny was small. Yeah, boy. What's this thing? It says take one, take a piece of candy. Sure, this is bound to be a trap. Okay, maybe not. You took a piece of candy, press C to do it. And look at it. Monster candy, though. Um, how do I go back? I don't want to press escape, because it quits. How do you go back? Zed? Oh, okay. Oh. What? Are you being serious? Okay, I'll take another one. You took more candy. <laughs> How disgusting, lol. Can I take more? What will they say? You take another piece. You feel like the scum of the earth. You took too much, too fast, the candy spills onto the floor. And I pick the candy up off of the floor. Look at what you've done. I call her then. I don't know. How the hell do I go back? No. Oh, X is to go back. Say hello, call her mum. Flirt. Wow, you weren't even joking. You can actually flirt. I'll just keep flirting with her chat. <laughs> oh dear, are you serious? I do not know if this is prophetic or endearing. <laughs> wow. Rude. Call her mum. This is Gloria. Huh? Did you just call me mum? Well, I suppose. Would that make you happy to call me mother? Well then, call me whatever you like. Hey Nara, yes, we are playing this beauty of a game. Should be fun. Oh dear. Let's talk. Console, what the hell is that? Check. You raise your arms and wiggle your fingers. Winston freaks out. I can't handle this! Lol. Winston <laughs> is hyperventilating. Console, halfway through your first word, Winston bursts into tears and run away. <laughs> Runs away, wow. 
But I want to gain XP. I want to get more love. Oh, what is that? Reason in particular, which do you prefer, cinnamon or butterscotch? Uh, let's go butterscotch. Oh, I see. Thank you very much. Uh, hello, this is Toya. You do not dislike cinnamon, do you? I know what your preference is, but would you turn up your nose if I, you found it on your plate? Right, right. I understand. Thank you for being patient. By the way. Toriel's so nice. Three out of four grey rocks recommend you to push them. Okay. Um, I don't want to terrorise. What does Shaq do? This monster is too sensitive to fight. Forgive me! Aww. Okay. Winsome is flattering. Halfway through your face, where he puts some bursts into tears and run away, as usual. Maybe we should attack it, but I'd feel bad. I would join next, but that would involve switching. Lol. <laughs> uh, there's a certain way you have to go. Like, oh, right, yeah. Here. And like that. And like that down. Let's talk to these froggets. Threat. Compliment. Froggit didn't understand what you said, but meow. What? <laughs> what the hell? They meow. Oh dear, that was close. You are intimidated by Froggit's raw strength. Forget didn't understand, but was flattered anyway. Rushes to get through. Okay, maybe I sh shouldn't do that. Let's try complimenting this one. Pop. Pop. Uh, wait, what? Forget seems real. Let's get that. Life is difficult for this enemy. Croak, croak. Rip. Ah! Seems reluctant to fight you. Can we have mercy then? Threat. But was scared anyway. Oh, you have to mercy them. Seems reluctant to fight you. Spare. Hey, we got the gods. Okay. So we're just going to have to follow this path. God damn, making me forget. I don't want to face you. I like how it doesn't attack like at all. It's pretty cute to be fair. Do I have to mercy you too? Halfway through your first word. Yep. They just run. Oh god damn! I knew it was close, I didn't realise it was that close. Let's not face the Whimsome. Let's terrorise it and then make it freak out and then leave because I don't want to attack it. <laughs> Goodbye, Whimsome. Now let's push these rocks, I guess. Rip. You tripped into a line of moulds. What? I don't want to fight. No, go back. You wiggle your hips. Mold small wiggles back. What a meaningful conversation. 
watch slime sounds. Oh dear. This does not look like it's gonna end well. Whew, that was close. Waits pensively. We can just mercy, can't we? Sure, that works. Well there, partner. Who said you could push me around? Hmm. So you're asking me to move over there? Okay, just for you, pumpkin. <laughs> hmm. You want me to move some more? Alrighty, how's this? Oh my god, please. Hmm. Is that the wrong direction? Okay, think you got it. Think I got it. That was nice. Oh god, yeah, I saw that happening. Hmm? You want me to stay there? You're giving me a real workout. He's gonna like pull up last minute. Oof. I was worried for a second. Knowing the mouse might one day leave its hole and get the cheese, it fills you with determination. Let's save. We can love this game, dude. This cheese has been here quite a long time. It's stuck to the table. Okay then. Um, that's a ghost. That doesn't look great. Are they gone yet? This ghost keeps saying Z. Z out loud repeatedly pretending to sleep. Move it with force. Do it. Here comes Napstab look. <laughs> sure. Flirt? Cheer? Let's cheer. You gave Napstab look a patient smile. Yeah. Oh, look. There the tears. Sad looks what? Um, I don't want to press them. But, I just weigh you down. I'm really not feeling up to it right now, so... <laughs> this is the best character. Okay then. Looks just a little bit better. I don't want to press them. I feel like she's already sad. He or she. I'd just weigh you down. Indeed you would. Please don't hurt me. Fine, we'll threaten you. You give Napstab look a, a cool look. Go ahead. Go on then, do it. Look. Holy moly. Damn. Looks just a little bit better. Should we give it a nice one? Have a sense of humor. Oh, I'm real funny. Ah, that was close. Cheer, keep cheering. Okay, cool. You told Napstab look a little joke. <laughs> Still crying. Feels bad. Cries every time. Cheering seems to have improved. Napstab's look smooth again and let's keep cheering. Napstab look wants you wants to show you something. Let me try. I call it Dapper Look. Do you like it? It's cutie. Napstab eagerly awaits your response. Let's cheer. Oh gee. I usually come to the ruins because nobody, there's nobody around, but today I met somebody nice. Oh, I'm rambling again. I'll get out of your way. Aw. Huh? Pretty sure the first time I played that part, I killed that enemy. Napstab, look. What's in here, then? Spider bake sale. All proceeds go to real spiders. Proceeds. Sure. Not yet. What about this? Leave 18. Damn, I don't have that much. Fine, we'll, we'll leave some for the spiders. Some spiders crawled down and gave you a donut. Oh crap, well then. Yeah, this game plays with you. It's great. Did you miss it? 
at a bake sale, down and to the right, coming into food made by spiders, four spiders, of spiders. Oh god. Did I just get a spider fucking donut? Yeah, I did. That's disgusting. Ribbit, ribbit, sigh. My friend never listens to me. Whenever I talk, they skip through the my words by pressing X. That's right, pressing X. Well, at least you listen to me. I want to not listen to him. Oh, not you too. <laughs> Lol. Ribbit, ribbit. I heard using, yep, making full screen. This is troubling to say the least. I missed that dialogue, I'm an idiot. Dude, just to make things easier for you, don't use that until facing a specific bus. Okay, thanks. I've heard you're quite merciful for a human. Surely you know by now that, yeah. I do know. What do you think? That's very helpful, it's bad. What do I think of that chat? I'm pretty sure this choice probably makes no difference, so let's say it's helpful. It is rather helpful. Remember, sparing it's just saying you won't fight. Maybe one day you'll have to do it even if their name isn't yellow. I just realised that it's been quite a while since I've cleaned up. I was not expecting to have company so soon. There are probably a lot of things lying about there and here. You can pick them up, but do not carry more than you need. Someday you might see something you really like. You will want a new room in your pockets for that. All these subtle tutorial tips. Migosp. Hold up close, okay then. Let's talk. I don't care. Oh. There's no, don't hurt me. Mold small verbal quietly. Okay, we can mercy mold small. Swing your arms, baby. <laughs> okay. Maybe. Migos doesn't have a guy in the world. Oh, we can spare them. Yay, we get gold, no XP though. There's just one switch. Okay. Should we fight some of them? I mean, Moldsmall never wants to fight plus. La la, just be yourself. <laughs> the monsters are actually quite nice, aren't they? Easy. Just get the gold. Where's the switch? Hey! Oh, I thought we chose the right one. Hey! It's our friends! I fell down a hole, now I can't get up. Go on without me. Wait, ghosts can fly, can't they? Oh well. <laughs> See ya, dude. What's here then? I mean, here's a switch. There's like, freaking all sorts about here. Ooh, don't wanna fall. Indeed, I'm playing Undertale, DJ. How goes it, dude? How are you doing? Thank you for that. It's a switch, press it. Yeah, sure, nothing happened. But I forgot. Press it? No, we don't need to press it, I don't think. Let's read this sign. The far door is not an exit, it simply marks a rotation in perspective. Okay. Let's just mercy uh, spare these. Mm -cha, mm -cha, mm -cha. Nothing much. It's going well, thank you, DJ. 
going very well. Going well for everyone, going good. So, I know there's a hidden switch. That's it, this one, is it? Yep, that's it. A pair of Vegetoids came out of the ground. Dinner, lol. Plants can't talk, dummy. Rip. Vegetoid gave a mysterious smile. Devour dinner. I don't know if I want to do dinner chat. Hey, I played a bit of it and I really loved what I did play of it. So now we're gonna play it all the way. You pat your stomach. Vegetoid offers a healthy meal. Eat your greens. Oh. We actually got the green. It smells like steamed carrot and peas. Let's dinner him. You pat your stomach. Eat your greens. Eat your greens. Give me that. Oh, stop hitting me. God, it's so difficult. Spare both of them. Hey, got him. Undertale is a masterpiece of games. Which switch in this room? heal soon. No, I didn't want to flee. Oh, lol. I've never fled before. That's quite funny. If you can read this, press the red switch. Let's press it. <laughs> yeah, I guess we'll go for a pacifist run. If you can read this, press the green switch. Is this it? I think that's it, yep. That is it. A pair of looks decide to pick on you. Well then. Don't pick on. Pick on? Finally, someone gets it. <laughs> Lol. Love that. Oh god, I'm gonna die. Um, first, let's show mercy on that. Da -da 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 -da. That was super close. Don't pick on. Please don't hit me, please. Mercy. I need to heal myself, man. I just finished genocide myself. Really? You just finished it? Well, ribbit ribbit just between you and me. I saw Tori out come out of here just a little while ago. She was carrying some groceries. I didn't ask what they were for. We're all too intimidated to talk to her, Ribbit. Okay, okay. Well, hello knife. You found the toy knife. What is that? Is that like a city or town? That's pretty cool. Let's go up here. Whoa! Spoilers! How do you find it? I'm still crying. Wow. Oh, Cracker Jack! How's it going, Cracker Jack? I thought that was DJ Bung that was saying that. No spoilers, please. Oh dear. How's it going, Cracker Jack? I'm doing well, thank you. Oh dear, that took longer than I thought it would. Oh, rip. How did you get here, my child? Are you hurt? Well then, I will heal you. I should not have left you alone for so long. It was irresponsible to try to surprise me, to surprise you like this. There. Well, I suppose I cannot hide it any longer. Come, small one. It's 
spoilers, spoilers, please. Seeing such a cute, tidy house in the ruins gives you determination. And let's save. Everything has given me determination today. Do you smell that? Surprise! It is a butterscotch cinnamon pie. I thought we might celebrate your arrival. I want you to have a nice time living here. So I will hold off on a snail pie for tonight. Yes, I know that, Cracker Jack. Thank you, Nix. Here, yeah, I have another surprise for you. Then let's find out what the surprise is. Give it to me. This is it. A room of your own. I hope you like it. Well, stroke. Is something burning? And make yourself a home. Oh, wow, this is super cute. Guess we're gonna sleep for a bit. <gasps> you found a slice of butter, scotch, cinnamon pie. Oh, thank you. Back to bed, I guess. Can we just keep going back to sleep, lol? Let's head on out. An empty photo frame. It's real dusty. Okay. Okay. <laughs> so now I just have to do the true pacifist. Just don't ever eat that pie. Well, rip bit late. <laughs> What's this one? It's Toriel's diary. Read the circled passage. Sure. You read the passage. Why did the skeleton want a friend? Because she was feeling lonely. The rest of the page is filled with jokes of cinema caliber. Fairs similar caliber. Under renovations, okay. <laughs> Rip if you are being serious about the pie. Let's go find Toriel. Up already, I see. I want you to know how glad I am to have someone here. There's so many old books I want to share. I want to show you my favorite bug hunting spot. I've also prepared a curriculum for your education. This may come as a surprise to you. Nah, it's fine. No need to tell the backstory. I'm sure the game will tell me the backstory as I go through. You have it, just don't eat it. I mean, I did just eat it, didn't I? <laughs> but I have always wanted to be a teacher. Actually, perhaps that... It's very surprising. Still, I'm glad to have you living here. Oh, did you want something? What is it? When can I go home? Or nothing? I say nothing. Well, talk to me again if you need anything. Oh, God. Do we have no choice but to ask when we can go home? size of the pie intimidates you too much for you to eat it. The stovetop is very clean. Toriel must use fire magic instead. Inside the cupboard are cookie cutters for gingerbread monsters. <laughs> oh. So I actually put it in my pocket. So I did. Okay, cool. 
For some reason, there's a brand name chocolate bar in the fridge. Okay. Well, let's see. Can we just go downstairs? Let's explore. I think you should play upstairs instead. Rip. <laughs> She's gonna keep on coming, isn't she? But it's dangerous to play here. Let's just keep going until she says, gets mad or something. It is drafty here, you'll catch a cold. When is she gonna give up? But it's dusty here, you'll catch a cough. Let's see how many fucking things she can come up with. There is nothing to see here. Yeah, please, DJ, please. Do you want to read a book? Oh my god, how many excuses are you going to come up with, Toriel? I do not like the game you are playing. Well, we're going to keep playing it until you do something. Why not go for a walk in the yard? But I want to keep going, Toriel. Really now? <laughs> I just love the effort the devs have put in. <laughs> she didn't even say anything that time. She's just like, dot, dot, dot. Oh god, she's just gonna keep, keep on dot, dot, dotting. If this is another dot, dot, dot. Okay, last one, chat. It's probably just gonna be a dot, dot, dot. Sad times, okay. Thank you, Cracker Jack. Oh, hello. Did you want to hear about the book I'm reading? This is called 72 Uses for Snails. How about it? Sure. Here is an exciting snail fact. Did you know that snails have a chainsaw like tongue called a rubula? Interesting. Yeah. Well, bother me if you need anything else. What is it? Um, yeah. How to exit the ruins. I have to do something. Stay here. What are you gonna do? I know, DJ. I know. No. Maybe I should have stayed there. Screw it. Let's go to our room. Let's see our books. It's an encyclopedia of subterranean plants. You open to the middle. Type for a group of wetland flowering plants with brown oblong seed pods, known more commonly as water sausages. Interesting. You peek inside. Scandalous. It's Toriel's socked drawer. Well then. Ah, the cactus. Truly the most sunder of plants. Okay then. It's a regular old bucket of snails. <laughs> Wait, that flower is very colourful. I'm guessing we can't. No. Definitely bigger than a twin side bed. <laughs> twin sized bed. Okay, let's go this way. Let's see how we can leave this place. I know, I know, Vader. Emotional journey. You wish to know how to return home, do you not? Ahead of us lies the end of the roads. A one-way exit to the rest of the underground. I'm going to destroy it. No one will ever be able to leave again. Now be a good child and go upstairs. Well, I'm not too sure what to do now. I'm gonna just go upstairs and see what happens. Okay, I guess we're gonna have to go chat tutorial. Every human that falls down here meets the same fate. I've seen it again and again. They come, they leave, they die. You 
naive child. If you leave the ruins, they, Asgore, will kill you. I am only protecting you. Do you understand? Go to your room. I, I, I would. Do not try to stop me. This is your final warning. Okay, let's go to my room. <laughs> the thing is... Oh. Wait, what? I thought I got stuck for a second. It's just how the thing works. Let's go to my room and see if this is actually an option. Is this the end of the game? Is this the end of the game, chat? Human, please. Wake up. You are the future of the humans and monsters. Whoa. Okay. What happens if we go to sleep again? Okay, no, the same. Gosh, that is creepy. Imagine you heard that in your ear. Chat, don't tell me what to do, lol. You're like, no! Did you guys get that in your playthrough? I didn't think so. You want to leave so badly? Hmm. You are just like the others. There's only one solution to this. Prove yourself. Prove to me you are strong enough to survive. Toriel blocks away. Talk. You couldn't think of any conversation topics. Oh god. Toriel looks free. Check. Knows best for you. I think I can talk my way out of this one. DJ, please, please. Got strike one. That's a strike one. Please, don't let me. Don't spoil me, dude. Don't spoil. Yes. I get, I get it, you're excited. No spoilers, please. Oh, oh dear, she's preparing a magical attack. You try to think of something to say again, but... Rip. Come on, let's, let's find something to say. Ironically, talking does not seem to be the solution to the situation. Okay. I guess no talking for us. It's more dying. What happens if you die then? Hmm. Wow. Okay, guys. Don't know if that's a tip or a spoiler. <laughs> Whoops. It's not really a spoiler, I guess. Fight, uh, don't fight me. Okay, I have to fight. Can I not show mercy and just walk away? So they do. No, she just put dot dot dot. She just ain't having any of that, please. That is right. Go upstairs. Hmm. I'm very sure this is not the thing to do, but I want to see what happens. Already? What will it take for you to learn your lesson? I did try sparing, but it doesn't do anything. Maybe I should just attack. Straight up attack. We're gonna just have to attack. Oh, can we give no? I was hoping we, we could give her a pie. Rip. I freaking missed. I thought you got another chance. I thought it bounced back. Oh 
Oh god, it's just gonna take a while. think of any topics to talk to her about, which is sad. I try to think of something to say, but again, but you have nothing. Nothing in your little mind you can think to say to spare her or anything. Toriel, why are you making me can. Eventually you will reach an exit. Asgore, do not let Asgore take your soul. This plan cannot be allowed to succeed. I didn't want to do that, but the game forces you, apparently. <laughs> Feels bad. Apparently, if you keep sparing her, she'll let you leave. <laughs> I hope you like your choice. After all, it's not as if you can go back and change fate in this world. It's kill or be killed. That old hag thought you could break the rules. She tried so hard to save you humans. But when it came down to it, <laughs> she couldn't even save herself. What an idiot. <laughs> I love the laugh of that thing. Well. Undertale. By Toby Fox, what a legend. Thanks guys. <laughs>